mother of pearl. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to Size Leg RC. Apologies that I have been absent for a little while. So a few personal things going on within the family, but all is good. Everything's happy. So all we've done today is we've just come back to the pump track, me and Richard. We've just got a couple of the bashers out. Um, I have brought this along because it is brushless. Um, it has been tampered with and it is fixed and hopefully everything's going to go all right with it. Let's just get a bit of footage of it. Absolutely no good when you go over a ramp and you're not looking what's happening and it just crashes and lands in a big heap. Oh, we have an issue with the steering, do we? We want to turn all the way. Let's look, let's investigate. It's not turning to the left. So boys and girls, the Absema's steering has, it just, it just decided it didn't want to turn left anymore. So we've got the jump shot out, until I can take the Absema back to the workshop. Oh, Jesus Christ. And the jump shot's clutch is just, just clutching its little brains out. So let's just have a watch. Stop looking at the camera. Oh, come on, clutch. Ah, I didn't catch that on camera. Yes. Oh, mine's gone off the edge again. <laughs> clutch, clutch, clutch. Oh, dear. Oh, my God. Oh, what the hell? That just definitely doesn't look right. I think I've got it working. Shit. Go. I'm just clutching to death again.
Ladies and gents, we've got a first. We haven't just broke a car on size leg RC. And that is a Fly Sky. That is actually an expensive and really decent, you know, well, not expensive, but really good. And it's broken. Oh well, done. <laughs> I, was, I was just like reacted really slowly. So to conclude the video, <laughs> the Absima. How do I word this? I haven't had a good inspection of it yet. I've just, I've literally just got home. Um, I'm going to spend a, a couple of hours one night next week in the shed, um, which is located behind me. I just really have a good look at it, basically. But <clears throat> looking at it, nothing looks broken. However, the servo saver doesn't look right. But it doesn't look broken. It just doesn't look right. If that makes sense. Um, the HPI jump shot. The clutch, I believe that's all that's wrong with it. I don't think it's broken. I think the clutch has just loosened itself off a little bit and done what a clutch is there to do. It's there to protect things, isn't it? So it was just slipping quite a lot. So I think that just might need tightening back up. On When I look at it, it might actually need a new clutch. I don't know. So, But I don't think it's nothing major. Uh, while the HPI, this is going to be the last time you see the HPI jump shot, um, I'm going to spend a little bit of time and money on it. Obviously, I'm not going to put a fortune into it because I'm, you know, I'm not made of money. But I'm going to get a few choice upgrades for it, which I think will really do it justice, um, what I've seen on the HPI website. Um, the Absema, that standard at the box comes with horrible plastic bushings, so that's going to get a bearing kit. That's pretty much all I want to do with that, bearing kit. Um, now, Richard's MT. I'm going to just see it again, just for the crack. Um... Anyway, Richard's MT-10, first time he's properly broke it. So he actually broke the, sh not the shock tower, the the body mount. Now that thing's taken a beating. On that, on that little pump track, that concrete pump track, that thing has took a beating. Um, and that's the first time he's broke that. But more interestingly, he broke the Fly Sky controller. Um, we looked at it, and I, we, without, again, without Richard stripping it and playing with it, the, the steering control just felt really loose, didn't feel like there was any spring action left in it. So Richard's going to do what Richard does and he's going to pull it apart, see if he can fix it. If it can be fixed, brilliant. If it can't, I believe he's just going to chuck a Dumbo on it. Good old faithful Dumbo RC. So yeah, thanks for watching everybody and I hope you join me on the next one. All the best.